Hi guys, we're back again. Ebony's with me this time, and we are doing red a red purple unboxing. Sorry, honey, this okay thing. Uh, this arrived a couple of days ago. Red Pawpaw is an Australian subscription, grocery subscription service. You pay $5 a month um, plus shipping. Shipping depends on where you live. We pay $17.75 in shipping. Um, but you get more than $30 worth of groceries. So, everybody and I thought we'd do it together today. So... And I found chips. Okay, first up we have... Rice crackers in cheese flavor by Peckish. So that's that's pretty cool. I wonder what they're like. I'll we'll have to t try them out. One day. They don't have any MSG in them for those people who care about those kind of things. Um, they have got rice flour for those people who don't like using normal flour. There's no normal flour in them. Yeah. Okay, let's try one. Yes. One for you. It actually tastes really nice. Tastes a lot like rice crackers, but cheesy. Very crispy. Not bad, actually. Mm. Okay. Alright. Next, we have some lightly salted. Pop chips um, from Veggie Chips. These are less than 100 calories. That's pretty good. Gluten free. Doesn't have any MSG and doesn't seem to have any. If it's gluten doesn't have any chemicals or any of that kind of stuff in it. So that's really, really good. Though. Some people can eat that because if they're not, if they're allowed to eat gluten free stuff, that's mm. okay. If they're not. And they can't eat it. Yeah, it doesn't have any doesn't have any nasties in it. You have to try these out too. It's actually made with tapioca flour. So I've no idea what they taste like. They taste a little bit plain. Mm. I like those. They remind me a lot of um, prawn crackers without the prawny taste. Not bad, I don't know. Hmm. I'm going to 10 out of a 10. 10 out of 10? Awesome. Oh, look, we've got another bag of them. <laughs> but they are cheese flavoured. These flavored. ones are cheese flavoured. These have got a lot more ingredients to them. Um, and the unflavoured, the plain ones, lightly salted ones, have no dairy in them. These ones because they're cheesy. Let's we'll try these ones out, shall we? Yeah. It says that they have sugar in them. I can taste a little bit of cheese on that. That one didn't taste like cheese. But they're sweeter than the salt, um, salted ones. Maybe this one will taste more like cheese. I got a cheese equation as well. Mm. Well, I think so. And would you believe we have a Number third packet? One. And it is. Well, I'm not going to eat these ones because these ones are lime and chili, and I don't like lime and chili. So, but yeah, so three packets of these veggie chips. They're actually not bad, I have to say. And considering I'm currently trying to lose weight, anything that's low in calories Boy. is a good thing. And next, next. We have can you read what that says? Uh, we have special ones. Special K. Um, biscuit moments, strawberry flavored. Yep. So ten biscuits and two per pack. You get two two biscuits per pack. And they are less than 110 calories, so they sound pretty good. Mmm. Wonder what they taste like. I don't know. We'll have to try them. You think we need to try them? Yeah. Because no. yeah. we can share them. Because I have two biscuits. We just... Sorry about all the crinkly crinkly noises. 
time to open the packet. Whoops, we'll just pull one of the biscuits out. Snap her in half. There you go. Not bad. Actually tastes quite nice. They're pretty good. No complaints over here. So far, I'm pretty impressed, mainly because it's all really yummy. I can yummy. taste some apricot and drush. I think it tastes like apricot. Yeah, it tastes like an apricot. Mm. Well, that's weird because it's it tastes strawberry. like apricot and. It doesn't quite look like the packet in the, on the inside. It's a lot paler. But not offensive in any way. I can taste apricot in a biscuit and some um, nice. What's it called again that they sprinkle on it? Like chocolate? Um, yeah, I think it's white chocolate or yogurt or something. I think that's what it's supposed to be. But it tastes really nice. Mm. I give it a 50 out of 50. <laughs> we go from 10 out of 10 to 50 out of 50. Okay, next we have a Cascade brewery, Breweries Lemon Lime and Bitters. I'll probably give this to Mum. Because she quite likes that. Um, yeah. It's and only a little can. But normally people mix drinks with these. Not drink can it straight. Can I get the next one? Yep. Okay, what's next? <gasps> next we have some white wings. Real apple and cinnamon pancakes. Which have real fruit in them apparently. Mm. But you mm. have to cook them and stuff. Well, obviously. But what they're saying is that they actually have fruit in them. Rather than just pretending to have fruit in them. So... And they've got pink lady apples in them, apparently. So, I have to try those ones out. Ooh. I don't think that's food. No. This is, um... Because it's grocery, sometimes you get not food stuff. This is a Imperial Leather Limited Edition Blue Lagoon Exotic Guava and Champaka Triple Moisturising Body Wash. Blue stuff. It's, it's um, shower gel. Ooh, it smells nice. Mmm, yeah, it smells like bubbles. It smells like a tropical island. It smells like lavender. Mm. It smells like lavender bubbles. It's me. Imperial Leather is um, it's one of those classic type brands, um, but this is obviously a very new kind of scent. So interested to try that out. Oh, now we're back to the food again. <laughs> We have a White Wings Black Label Dessert. And it looks like pudding. It is. it is. It's chocolate fondant. These are actually really kind of hard to make, so I'm hoping that the recipe makes it really, really easy. But it's like a pudding, and then when you cut into it, it the centre just out. oozes out of it if you make it properly. Like the video that, uh, like the video I watched, the one that spider has a green goo in it, when you bite into it, it goes... Ugh. Pretty much like that. So there's something else that somebody will have to make. That's not good for the diet. Yeah. Uh, next we have a little container of <gasps> Goldwood Valley Australian Two Fruits diced in mixed berry nectar. Mm. We like fruit around here, so this probably won't last very long. Probably going to last longer vanish. in my belly then. <laughs> <laughs> it lasts longer in a belly than it does in, in the cupboard. Because I like that stuff. It tastes really, really nice. Um, and we have a... That looks mayo. spicy. Um, yeah, it's a type of mustard. As you can see, it's a very, very seed-heavy mustard. It looks like, um, looks like there's pepper seeds in it. Mm, they're mustard seeds. It's... Um, a I don't think I want that. I think Dad would like that. I've, I've never actually heard the name before, but it's a whole grain mustard. So. I think that um, Dad would like that. He probably would. And last but not least, we have some Paul Newman's own light ranch dressing. I don't usually have light ranch dressing, but it's that's fine. I use it like mayo. Um, yeah, so that's that's pretty good. So you use everything that's pale white. That's mm. mayo. Oh. I like mayo. So what do you reckon of the box, Ebs? Uh, I give the box 
600 out of 600. 600 out of 600. Obviously, Red Paw Paw did well this time. Uh, yeah, so that was our Red Paw Paw box for November. Um, yeah, I will leave information in the down bar. And if you want to see more of this kind of thing, then you can subscribe. And, you know, you can always like the video because that tells me I'm doing the right thing. Um, anyway, we will see you next time. See ya. See ya.